Hi everyone, it's Carlene again with another video for my friends at AllFreeHolidayCrafts.com. Today we're going to be making a super cute Easter wall hanging. So the supplies that you'll be needing are some recycled cardboard, and this measures 11 by 7. I also have another piece of cardboard. This measures 7 by 7. And I've also drawn a sketch of an Easter bunny's head that looks like that. And this will be available as well on the website. And then what I did for, for filming sake is I glued a piece of white cardstock to the back. You're also going to be needing you're also going to be needing an 11 by 9 scrapbook paper and a 5 by 7 scrapbook paper. You're going to be needing a flower embellishment, one ruffle trim, another pink trim and a, a 1 8 inch ribbon and these are all 12 inches long. You're going to be needing some liquid glue, a marker, your scissors, some bendable wire, and you're going to be needing a Cricut sticker or you can also print the saying out on your computer and your hot glue gun. So let's get started. Okay, the first thing that I want to do is I want to take the drawing of the bunny and the reason I put this paper on first is so it could be dried by the time I started my video so that I can cut the bunny's head out and let's change to a larger scissors and see if I can do this. Alright, so it's going to take some time to do this but it's totally going to be worth it. You can come in to this section here and then switch out scissors if you need to. This one's smaller so it's easier to get into the grooves. Fine. Okay, so what you want to do is we're going to cover the cardboard with our first layer of scrapbook paper and we're just going to just put some glue down and then you also want to put some in the middle And then the next thing is take your second layer and place it down in the center. So again, put some glue down. And in the middle. And then center. Okay, so the next thing is I have made a sticker on my Cricut with black vinyl and I've cut out the word Hoppy Easter. So I'm just going to burnish the letters down 
and make sure that they stick. And then you should be able to just peel off the backing. Just come back and you place the words wherever you want them. So first I'm going to put Hoppy at the top here. And we're going to adhere that to our paper. And then just peel away. And then Easter can go right beneath it. And then burnish again. And if you don't have a Cricut machine, you can also just print this out on your computer. There we go. So it says Hoppy Easter. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take our Easter Bunny and I want to just draw a cute face on him. So we're going to make two eyes here and you can practice on another sheet of paper if you wish. Color his nose in. And then you just draw a line and a little circle. And then three whiskers like that. And so that's all you have to do for his face. Then you want to take your ribbon and I want the pink side showing. Actually we're going to let the green side show and then just tie a little bow and I keep calling it a him but it's a her. Alright so there's your bow just want to trim the edges the bunny is actually going to be going on the top here but I'm going to glue it on the back like this so let's um, kind of figure out about where that's going to go so right there and we just put our hot glue on the bottom And then place your bunny in the middle there. And now we're going to put two holes on the corners. And I'm going to use my crocodile, and I'll use the larger hole setting. So there's one. There's the second. Now if you don't have a crocodile, you can also use a craft knife, maybe even your scissors, but be very, very careful. Okay, so here's my bendable wire. We're going to thread this through the first hole and this is just going to wrap around like this.
and then this is going to go over the head, the bunny's head, and we'll go ahead and cut right about here. And again, thread that through, and then just start twisting this around. And then go ahead and bend it to the shape you want. Just like that. Now all I need to do is I'm going to glue my flower to this corner. And you might need to cut off the stem part of your flower. that and now we still need to do this bottom part so this lace right here is actually going to be glued to the back so let's turn that over we'll put some hot glue on the bottom and then face it forward so the back the wrong side is facing you and then just go ahead and place it down and you can hold it in place as well now I'll turn it over and I like to t trim it at an angle so I don't trim it straight like this I trim it at an angle like this. Uh, let me cut a little bit more. There we go. And same thing on this side. Like that. And then this last ribbon <coughs> goes right on top to finish that off. And there's your super cute Easter wall hanging. I hope you like this project and for more project ideas, please visit my friends at allfreeholidaycrafts.com. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time.